Coming to you live from the Verizon Center in Washington, it's the Washington Wizards and the Miami Heat. Hi everybody, I'm Marv Albert along with Steve Kerr. Steve, as we get started, what are the keys for the Wizards here tonight? Marv, I think they really have to run Shaquille O'Neal. They can't let him get so comfortable on the floor that he can do whatever he wants. So put somebody in there who can really run the floor, force him to get back defensively. This one is underway. Williams looks to the bench. He fires from downtown. Thomas on the rebound. Here's Alinas. Well, how about the speed of this clock getting up and down the court so quickly? Williams looks to set it up. The pass picked off. Arenas again. Gilbert's Terrific Arenas. job in the open floor, Marv, creating an easy basket. And they're really trying to push the tempo here in the first half. Wade penetrating. Oh, a flamed point. Finish. Well, terrific use of that quickness, Marv. He gets all the way to the basket. Arenas on the hop, and Antoine Candace and right back. Williams working up high. Here's Wade, and Dwayne Wade able to knock it down. Well, as a coach, I mean, that's what you want. You want to get players in areas where they're comfortable and you know, guys that talented and that good, they're going to make a high percentage of those shots. Williams trying to stay in front of him. Nice pass inside. And Deshaun Stevenson not able to hit. Marv, they did a terrific job getting the ball in the paint. They just didn't make the basket. And puts it down. Arenas kicks it out. Nice entry pass. And Antoine Jamison comes up short. Williams looking for the open man. Yes! And the foul. Boy, what a physical play that was. The hard foul, but he was still able to convert the basket. Well, Steve, for the Miami Heat, it has been an explosive combination. The diesel, Shaquille O'Neal, and uh, the man... He nicknamed Flash Dwayne Wade. Well, there's a reason Pat Riley wouldn't trade Wade in that O'Neal deal several years ago. He wanted to see Wade and Shaq together, and, and the results speak for themselves. These guys complement one another so well, the inside-out combination, and they seem to have a, a synergy together that, uh, that really spurs this team on. Williams directing traffic Changing defense is, is an important way of disrupting the flow of the offense, Marv. They're going to go back to a man here. O'Neal with the shot. Shaquille O'Neal. Nice pass inside. And stops. That was a three-point attempt. He can make that one in his sleep, Marvin. That, that's his comfort zone, and I don't care what you do defensively. If he gets in that spot, he's going to make that nine times out of ten. They're going to switch up from a zone to man-to-man -man here, Marv. Try to disrupt the offense. Two minutes to go. In Williams the first now running the team. And that's a three-second violation. violation. Well, no matter what Miami. the strategy coming into a ball game, Marvin, everything in basketball comes down to valuing the ball and making the most of each possession. You've got to rebound, you've got to defend, and you've got to take care of the ball. And that's that's a careless Anton mistake there. Jameson. Williams setting things up. Here's Wade, 
And Dwayne Wade not able to hit. Boy, we've seen him make that shot so often from that spot. That, that's one of the areas on the floor that he just loves. Even with the defense all over him, he's able to drain it. That's an 8-0 run for the Wizards. Marv, they are on a nice run right now, and you can feel this crowd is fired up. And Shaquille O'Neal right Shaquille back. Shaquille O'Neal. Really important, Marv, for a shooter early in ballgames to get a couple of shots in areas where he's comfortable from. That establishes his rhythm. That gets him going for the rest of the game. Jamison on a quick release. I like the game plan here, Marv. They're playing with a purpose. They're getting shots in spots they're comfortable in, and they're really executing offensively. Not able to hit. Well, they did a nice job offensively, Marv, but they just did not finish the play. Here's Jamison. Anton Jamison! Nice play. And he puts it down. Shaquille O'Neal. Marv, this is an excellent two-for-one opportunity. This club can build its lead if they handle the clock correctly. Oh, what a pass. And Shaquille O'Neal not able to score. Good job clogging the lane, Marv, not allowing anything easy at the basket. Arenas setting it up. Nice entry pass. And Antoine, Antoine Jameson, Jameson able to hit. That's great stuff, Marv. Early in the game, it's always important to establish a game plan, play with a purpose, get shots where you're comfortable, and really establish that offensive rhythm. And they clear it out. Wade with the open three. So at the end of the first quarter, the Wizards lead by five. What a bizarre first quarter. Every shot from every angle going in. And for both teams, Mar, they, they were on fire out there. But you know, this is such a long game. You can't expect this for the full 48 minutes. So I look for both defenses to tighten up here in the second quarter. Williams able to extend. Here's Butler. And Antoine Walker called for the foul. That's his first. And he makes them both. Williams setting up. Delivery to Wade. Wade wide open. Box out by Butler. Nice offensive possession, Marv. They just couldn't get the shot to go. And Gilbert Arenas yeah. able to put it down. That's a pretty oh, easy yeah. hoop there, Marv. They got to tighten up that defense. Williams running the clock. Here's O'Neal. And Shaquille O'Neal will put it Shaquille home. Shaquille O'Neal. More of offensive rebounding is about quickness and anticipation. It's a terrific play there. Arenas working at the point. Beautiful defensive move. Well, close Wayne game Wayne. here early on, so this club Trying to force the issue, get out and get some easy buckets. Arenas setting it up. Delivery to Stevenson. Williams with a layup opportunity. Shaquille O'Neal puts it down. Arenas at the point. Nice pass inside. And Antoine Jamison able to put it down. Jamison! Williams comes across. Good job by Arenas. And a foul is called. Well, he slides over to try to take the charge, but he's too late. Draws the contact, but he picks up the foul. 
Williams looking for that low post. Shaquille O'Neal. Nice entry pass. Here's Jamison. And Pat Riley takes a timeout. Washington. Miami Number now has five timeouts left. Haywood. Walker with a nice pass. If they're going to hang on to this lead, Mark, they've got to continue to defend like they did that time. Here's Arenas. Mark, this club is doing a great Arena. job getting the ball up the court and getting some easy baskets. Good job by Butler. Two minutes to go. In the Walker second fires one up. Rebound by Arenas. Great defense here, Mark, forcing a very difficult attempt. Jamison with the move. Anton Jamison. Good job by Arenas. Williams at the line. He's an 86% free throw shooter. And hits both. Three and a half gone by in the quarter. Wizards up by five. Jamison again. And yes. Jamison. The Heat clear it out. Wade putting the speed on. Come the Wizards. Arenas able to break it down. Gilbert Arenas. And again, Washington on the run. Arenas looking to make his move. That was nice, Mark. He got fouled Arenas. hard and still slammed it home. Arena Smarv, of course, really took off when he arrived here in Washington playing for Coach Eddie Jordan. And you can see the chemistry that they have between them. A lot of trust there. Delivery to Walker. Walker fires. And what a Antoine great shot, Walker. Marv. Defensively, that's all you can do. Contest the shot and hope for the best. Arenas working on the perimeter and timeout Into the called game late Miami, in this first half. Miami Shaquille now has four timeouts left. Stevenson giving no room. Couldn't quite beat his opponent to the spot, Marv, and that's why he picks up the block. Rebounded by Butler. Down to a half minute remaining in the half. Wizards up by nine. And gets the friendly roll. Terrific Jameson. offense, Marv. They get an easy bucket because of solid execution. Williams on the hop. Here's the double. O'Neal firing. They clear it out. Five seconds remaining in the quarter. Here's Arenas. And 
And on that note, the second quarter is finished. The Wizards lead by 11. The Wizards with an outstanding first half, Steve, and spending time with the coaches prior to the game. They were very concerned about the effort on the defensive end, but that's not the case here tonight. Well, you're right, Marv. The defense was alert and active. They came out with a lot of energy. I think this team was extremely focused when they came into this ball game, and now they've got a comfortable lead, but to maintain it, they're going to have to continue to play well. Arenas moving to the front court. And they clear it out. Arenas accelerating. And Gilbert Arenas converts. Gilbert Arenas. Once again, poor defense, Marv. Leads to the easy hoop. They've got to tighten things up here. Wade draws the double. And the bucket. Shaquille O'Neal. Well, the zone was not working, Marv. Too many easy shots. They're going to go back to the man. And Antoine Walker blows the layup. Here come the Wizards. Offensive foul on Butler. Williams gets inside. Good job by Arenas. Williams takes to the rim. Now they're in big trouble, Marv. I'm not sure if you can stay in the game with one of your stars on the bench, but they have to sit him down now. He's got four. Haywood has Into come on. For Washington, number 33, Brendan Haywood. And he makes them both. Nice pass inside. And the field goal. Well, it's the same thing we saw in the first half, Marv. This team is giving up wide open shots on the perimeter. These are good shooters out there. at the line for the first time. The zone really wasn't effective. Well, that's why they were trailing. That's why they'll go back to this man-to-man. -man. Nice entry pass. And Shaquille O'Neal off the mark. That's good, solid defense there, Marv. Very aggressive. Butler to the rim. Good interior defense there, Marv. You've got to contest every shot. That's exactly what these guys are doing. Shaquille O'Neal. Seven on the 24. And Karan Butler comes up short. Well, I like this strategy, Marvin. Change up, go from the zone to the man-to-man. -man. Try to keep Wayne. that offense off balance. Well, that's what you like to see. When you're down, it's important to really be aggressive and try to get to the rim or the free throw line. Butler with a wide open shot. Well, that's a rare mistake for this club. They've been so good tonight with their execution. they got to get back to getting good shots at the basket, good solid possessions each time down the floor. Nice pass. Jumper off the mark. Walker looking for the opening. Antoine Walker.
Nice pass inside. And Antoine Jamison not able to hit. Here come the Heat. Walker on the hop. Jason and Jason Williams. Williams able to hit. That's an 8-0 run for the Heat. Marv, you have to love the fortitude of this team. They were down, but they've made this great comeback by continuing to play hard defensively two, on the boards. They're sharing the ball. They're really clicking on all cylinders now. Williams working the point. Good job by Daniels. Accelerates. Williams kicks it back out. Shot clock at seven. Nice entry pass. And Jason Williams not able to hit. I love what they're doing here. Contesting shots and trying to build their lead. And Nick Young could not finish. Second chance points, Mar. They kill you. You've got to secure that defensive rebound. They clear it out. Miami cannot find an opening. Williams with the shot. Nice box out by Jamison. Well, you love his confidence, Mar, but you have to question his judgment on that shot. That's a long-range, difficult attempt. Four-second differential between the game clock and the shot clock. Wade puts the speed on, and Dwayne Wade off the mark. Haslam has to pop it back out. Good job by Jamison. Miami gets it across, accelerates. Here's the double, and Jason Williams comes up short. Three quarters of this one have been played. The Wizards lead by nine. Well, as we head to the fourth quarter, the home crowd has to be pleased what they have seen to this point. Well, I think so, Marv. Their team has played very well, at least through the first three quarters. But, you know, they've got to be careful in this fourth quarter. They've got to continue to take care of the basketball and execute offensively if they're going to maintain this lead. Butler on the hop. Well, good offense usually leads to a high percentage shot. Nice effort there, Marv. And they've pretty much given up on the zone here, Marv. It was not working, so you switch up to the man-to-man. -man. Marv, that's what the fans come out to see. An amazing athlete going up, hammering home the dunk, and drawing the foul. So not able to complete the conventional three-point play. Arenas able to extend. What great body control to be able to complete that play even while drawing the foul. He is not able to take advantage of a three-point play possibility. Anton well, this will drive coaches crazy. You work so hard defensively to stop a team from scoring, and then you give them the offensive rebound off the missed free throw. Jason Williams. And a foul is called. Jamison down low and score. Anton Jameson. Jameson is 14 for 21 from the field. Williams, nice move. That's terrific defense there, Marv. You've got to aggressively contest every shot. They're doing that right now. And Gilbert Arenas able to flip Gilbert it home. That's a 14 to 4 run for the Wizards. Well, at this point, Marv, if you're coaching, you might want to get a timeout because you're starting to lose a grip on this game. Williams trying to stay in front of him. Here's Jamison. The Wizards will get it back. Out of bounds. Fourth quarter Washington execution is just so important, Marvin. A big part of it is, is obviously you want to score, but you, you, you don't want to turn the ball over. You just want to get every crack you can at the basket. Just give yourself a chance. Jamison with the shot. 
Well, he really bailed the defense out there. Mark, plenty of time on the shot clock, and that's a difficult attempt. You got to work the ball a little bit, make this Wayne defense Wayne. defend. Two minutes gone by in the fourth. Wizards up by 13. Arenas looking to set up. Nice pass inside. And Antoine Jameson not able to hit. Thomas fires one up. That's just too easy, Mark. You can't give up offensive rebound opportunities when you're trailing. Williams with a layup opportunity. And Udonis Haslam will put Haslund. it home. Well, anytime you're trailing, Marv, you got to get back into the ballgame with hustle and energy. Arenas now running the offense. Good job by Williams. Gilbert Arenas. Williams playing the point. Here's Wade. And Dwayne Wade off the mark. Bob, I am very impressed with this club defensively. They are getting after it and really challenging every shot. Walker facing the double. Antoine Walker. Here's Arenas. Handled by O'Neal. O'Neal to the front court. For three. And Antoine Walker Antoine hits the three. Walker for three. Three and a half gone by in the fourth quarter. Wizards up by ten. Williams giving no room. Washington moves it across. And they clear it out. Shot clock is down to six. Down to three. And Gilbert Arenas with 23 points. Williams moving it across. Accelerates. He fires from downtown. Not able to hit the three. Into the and game. timeout taken late Number here two. in the Nick fourth. Young. Here's Jamison. Anton Jamison. Jamison with a nice pass. Delivery to Walker. Well, to try to cut into this league, Marv, they're going to go zone. They switched up from the man-to-man. -man. Every coach in the league will tell you, Marv, defense and rebounding is what wins games. You look at the numbers, and that's how they built the lead to this point. They clear it out. Six on the 24. Arenas with the shot clock going down. We're down to the final seconds. Haslam with room for three. And that will do it. The Wizards have won it. The final score is 71 to 55. Antoine Jameson, the high man, with 30 points. This is Marv Albert along with Steve Kerr saying so long from the Verizon Center in Washington. For tonight's outstanding performance, we're proud to present the Jordan Player of the Game.